Hey, what's up everyone? In this one, I'm gonna be looking at a 2015 Chevy Equinox, inspecting it for oil leaks. The tires on this one are pretty bold, so all four of these tires are changed. So um, this vehicle is smog ready, so um, after this, we're gonna be able to take it to the smog shop. Appreciate everybody who subscribed and liked. Trying to make it to 100 subscribers by the end of this month. I need 24 more subscribers, so if you guys could please subscribe to the channel and like, greatly appreciate it. Hope everyone's having a great week, great day, a good 2021. Okay, so checking the, the piping. The spring, the absorber. Checking the bushings. The lower control arm. Okay, checking for any structural damage. See if there was any accidents from the rear, looking good. Okay, okay, now we're gonna be checking for oil leaks. Okay, the oil pan right here. Transmission, that's the, one of the drain plugs. I think that axle got some seepage, tiny, tiny bit. You see the axle boot, the end links, ball joint. Sorry for it being dark, guys. I don't have my flashlight on me. I don't really need it right here. Check it for leaks. Starter, looks like it has some oil on it. This might have a, uh, there probably is a valve cover gasket seepage. There's an original belt on there from Mexico. I just got an uh, AC compressor for a 2015 uh, Chevy uh, Camaro that I'm working on. Do a video on it and, and the parts in Mexico too and it's a GM part. Good yeah. old Mexico. That seepage right here. The axle shaft seal. Appreciate everybody who's liked and subscribed. I'm gonna be dropping this car. Maybe taking that on the road, finish up the report. It's Tuesday at the shop. It's like, it's not slow, it's not fast, it's just steady right now. I just got back from Toyota of Riverside, dropped, or Lexus of Riverside, sorry, dropped off a, uh, a Lexus truck. Didn't do a video on that one. It wasn't really fun. Phil might do a video, but like, subscribe. Peace, y'all.